Hi everyone, Scott Smith at Rusnak BMW in Southern California. Got this nicely, nicely equipped, brand new BMW M235 Coupe in. We've got some cool accessories on it from BMW. Really wanted to shoot a video. I love these cars, dollar for dollar. This is one quick car. Lots, lots of standard equipment too. A lot of M stuff included. You know, it's got its own custom bodywork. Awesome wheels, M performance brakes, M adaptive suspension. And this one we put some cool accessories on from BMW. So thought Johnson will give you a little rev time here in just regular idle. And then he's gonna put it in neutral and turn on the sport button, give you a little throaty sound. <laughs> Cool, so pretty cool. So now he'll put it in neutral and put on the sport button. <laughs> that thing definitely likes to burp up, doesn't it? Check out that rear diffuser that comes with the um, upgraded M Performance exhaust. We'll get to the sticker in a minute with some of the cool BMW stuff that we put on here. Car weighs 35. Uh, just over 3,500 pounds, 3535 empty vehicle. Just under 176 inches long, zero to 60. BMW's got it to 4.6. One of the magazines has gotten it down to 4.4. Thanks, Johnson. Down to 4.4 uh, with the two-wheel drive. BMW's got the all-wheel drive version clocked at 4.4. And it weighs about 160 pounds more with the all-wheel drive. Great engine. Three liter, twin power turbo technology. The adaptive Xenons, lighting package or Xenons, I guess I should say, has come standard. Pretty cool, because they will turn left to right, lead you into turns. Outside light will turn up to 15, degree, 15 degrees to help you look around the corners when you're up in the hills. So you can see here, this one's been ordered with the black kidney grill. We've left the front license plate mount off. It's for the next owner. They can decide to have it drilled into the bumper or take their chances with California law. <laughs> we got the uh, carbon fiber mirror covers. Let me show you these great looking wheels. And I think I'm correct in saying this was the first car that came in with the gray wheels. Um, and now we've opened up this colored wheel, not this exact design, but on our other vehicles. So, especially I know the 3 Series this year and the 2015s have got some really nice looking gray colored wheel designs. Let's get to the sticker. So you can see here, 2015. Whoop, let's just get the old, I know with the glass and the paper behind it, having a little issue with my, but go down the list here. You guys can always pause it if you want. This one's got pretty much all the good options on it. Get down to the bottom, show you some of the cool accessories we had port installed for BMW. As you can see there, got some interior trim, M performance exhaust with the rear diffuser, carbon mirrors, you got the chrome tips, got all kinds of good stuff on here. This is about the most expensive M235 I've seen sticker wise. Just under 56. Get some decent gas mileage, 2132. There's your final assembly, parts information. You can see here we've got the black shadow line trim around the windows. So it's great if you tint your windows, gives it a great look. Let's go on and look back at the rear diffuser again. It's almost got pretty much a matte finish to it. Really nice upgrade, not to say that the standard one isn't beautiful, but it's a nice touch, a little bit personalized. You can 
see on the chrome tips. Get a nice little M signature there. I like the dark mirrored uh, 235 too. Nice touch with the M symbol. Got your standard little spoiler. Got your fold down 60-40 split seats. And these cars do come with performance tires. Not performance performance run flats. These are real good traditional high performance tires. Batteries in the back for better balancing. Got a power source in the back just in case. This one's in your Alpine white with the black interior. Sure is a nice touch with some of the carbon fiber. Wait till we get inside. Right, as you can see, you got your signature there inside the door seal. Let's put the seat back a little bit. Give you a better shot of the of the steering wheel in just a second. But it is a two plus two seating. And you've actually got pretty good room in the back. So for adults, average size adults, definitely. Just hold on to your hats when you're heading up in the canyons in this car. Air conditioning power source. They also are heating vents also. Here's your quick re quick adjustment on the rear, I mean on the front seat. So it's quicker than the lower button. Getting in and out, reaching from the back or the front. All right, there we go. Big gauges, easy to read. Also, you can see here, this one's got the Driver's Assistance Plus package. It'll read the um, street signs uh, for the speed limits on the streets you're traveling on and indicate it and have it there for you. There's a camera up here in the mirror. Has the accident avoidance technology, so it will give you an alert. You can set it for early, mid, or late, and it will apply the brakes for a very short period of time. So you do definitely have to stay aware of your driving and your surroundings and everything but it is a a nice feature to at least start to activate the brakes give you a warning that you're coming too fast to an object in front of you great paddles great nav screen 4.2 version 20 gig hard drive great resolution quick fast check out the interior trim Alcantara, nice suede feel, door handles, and carbon fiber. Also right down here along the center console. Touchpad controller, your iDrive system. Great voice command too, so just to let you know, a lot of verbal you can do with this command system. Deep cup holders. Good storage in the center armrest. Plug in your iPhone or Android. We got a lot of wireless with the um, navigation iDrive system. So there's a lot you can do without having to plug in. Got your black headliner. Moonroof is standard. It is tinted glass to protect you. This one does have the Harman Kardon sound system. Going a little over 3,000 RPM there. It's got a nice burp coming out of the back. <laughs> it's almost like it's laughing at you, huh? It's like, please, take me up in the hills. Nice M235 there on the screen in the display when you turn it off. So just a nice touch, you know? It's all the little cool things they've done on this car. You know, and have this car to start a ways under 50 grand. Um, and there's a lot you can add to this car. Um, to keep it under 50 grand. I mean, I know this one's maxed out with some really neat accessories. Eight speed sport transmission. Got your sport button, Eco Pro. There's your sensors for you, just like putting it into reverse. As you can see up on the screen, that lower part there is your actual bumper. And I've turned on the 
obstacle warnings and the line. So you can see it's a clean, big screen, easy, easy to read camera. You got your sensors there on the right, Whoosh, right there. <laughs> Great design on the rear view mirror. Nice and curved. Compass, garage door openers, auto dimming. Yeah. Let's go on a... Oh, someone just walked in behind us there. Let's go ahead and put it in drive. Oh, one thing I wanted to show you. You go down into drive, even put it in the sport automatic or manual. You go ahead and just turn the car off and it'll automatically put it into park and move the gear shift over for you. Pretty cool, huh? Man, that exhaust sounds great. Let me give you another shot of the outside. Hey, thanks for watching, guys. Share it with your other media sources. If you definitely want one of these or another BMW, come on and see me over here at Rusnak BMW. Scott Smith, thanks for watching.